Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. Hello, my dear students. Welcome back to our English lessons. Today, inshallah, we're going to study or complete our unit entitled Authors. First of all, let's take this opener. Write words which begin with the letter J. You can pause our video to write them. Now, let's see these words. Japan, Jungle, Jeddah, Jump, Join, Jacket, Jews, Jeep, Jam, Jellyfish, Jaguar, Judge, and Journalist. Let's go on. JP is the last word. Now let's go on. Now, my dear students, Open your student's book, page 23. Now, our grammar lesson today is Future Simple Tense. Let's start. What are the differences between will and going to? Going to is used for future plans. For example, I am going to buy a new car. I am going to buy a new car. Going to is also used for predictions with evidence. For example, Look at those clouds. It's going to rain soon. Look at those clouds. It's going to rain soon. Now, what are you going to do this evening? Think before answering and say, What are you going to do this evening? Are you going to Watch TV? Are you going to um, read a book? Are you, are you going to visit your grandpa? Now you can answer. I am going to read a book. I am going to watch TV. I am going to visit my grandpa. Now, well. Well is used for future events. For example, you seem cold. I will make you some hot soup. You seem cold. I will make you some hot soup. Well is also used for predictions but without evidence. For example, this movie is great. You will love it. This movie is great. You will love it. There is no evidence here. Well is also used for quick decisions. For example, Oh, it's raining. I will take my umbrella. Oh, it's raining. I will take my umbrella. Well is also used for making offers. For example, you seem busy. I will pick up kids from school today. You seem busy. I will pick up kids from school today. Well is also used for making promises. 
For example, don't worry, I will be careful. Don't worry, I will be careful. Where will you spend your next holiday? Where will you spend your next holiday? Think before answering. Will you spend it in Cairo, London, America? Say, the answer will be, I will travel to London. I will travel to Cairo. I will travel to Paris. Let's go on. Now, let's check your understanding. Choose the correct answers. Now, pause your video and read these sentences to choose the correct answers. Now, let's check your answers. Our teacher has decided to take us to the school library next Monday. We are going to have, will have, have a lesson there. The answer is... Our teacher has decided to take us to the school library next Monday. We are going to have a lesson there. Let's go on. I think we will enjoy, are enjoying, are going to enjoy it. The answer will be, I think we will enjoy it. Everyone will read, is going to read, reads a different book and write a review of it. The answer will be, Everyone is going to read a different book and write a review of it. I hope I am finding, am going to find, will find something about science fiction, my favorite subject. The answer is, I hope I will find. Something about science fiction, my favorite subject. Probably the teacher chooses, will choose, is going to choose the best review and publish it in the school magazine. The answer is probably the teacher will choose the best review and publish it into the school magazine. Now, this is our closure for today. Your friends from England are visiting Kuwait for the first time during the weekend. So, you want to show them the beauty of Kuwait and give them a good time. Now, working groups can do that with your friends, neighbors, or relatives. Discuss and decide on a visit itinerary for your friends. Think about where will you go? What will you do? What you will show your friends? Where you will stay? What souvenirs you will buy? Now, pause the video to think about your answers. B. When you have finished, present your plan itinerary to the class using going to. Remember to use well when you make decisions. Time to read your plan itinerary to the class. Weekend, 
Thursday, Friday, Saturday, morning, afternoon, evening. On Saturday, on Thursday morning, we are going to pick up our friends from the airport at 9 a.m. And on Saturday evening, we are going to drop off our friends at the airport at 9 p.m. Now, my dear students, thank you for today. See you next time. Goodbye.